Hey, what's going on, Aesop family? It's your boy Troop. That's Truth, Truth Over Narrative, man. And hey, we gotta bring it from the car this time. It is what it is, man. We gotta get the news out. We gonna we gonna bust it up. So, um, they just announced that Regis Prograde versus uh Chon Zapata. Um, Jose Zapata is gonna be November 26th. Um, I think I'm I'm glad they, they finally got a good fight, as everybody know. Uh, the first bid was won by Marv Nation, which is really a, a local, I guess, promoter out of the Southern California area. So it it, it does uh, it, it doesn't surprise me that this fight is going to be held uh, in Southern California somewhere. Um, we'll see what the ticket prices are. Um, I may have to make a trip out for that one. You never know. But at the end of the day, yeah, um, I'm just excited for this, man. Uh, I think Reach Progray is one of the best, maybe if not the best, top two, top three, 140 pounders in the world. Um, we've seen uh, Charles Zapata. Obviously, I believe that was a 2020 fight of the year with Ivan uh, Barian check. After that, he came out, had a very lackluster performance against um, Hank Lundy. Some thought he lost that fight. Um, after that, remember he, he knocked out uh, Josue Vargas in one round. I believe he had a fight in Mexico after, just like a keep busy fight. Um, so yeah, man, that, this this fight for that WBC 140 strap, man, this is is a real interesting uh, fact. Just another fact I want to throw out there. Uh, we do believe that um, uh, Gary Antoine Russell also possibly maybe going that WBC route. So I would love in my mind, right, if we make it matchups, I would love to see a potential matchup with Gary Antoine and uh, Regis Progre. Both uh, southpaws and also Charles Avey is a southpaw as well. But I would just love, I mean, I think the fans would definitely salivate over a pro grade versus um, uh, Antoine Russell, Gary Antoine Russell. Um, but yeah, man, I just I just want to bring that, drop that news off to the people, man. Um, I think I think this is going to be a real good fight, man. I think it definitely has the potential to be fight of the year. Um, Regis Progre, obviously, remember, uh, he had some issues a couple times making 140. His last fight versus Tyrone McKenna uh, was a, on a probellum car over in Dubai. Um, he did actually come in under the the, the 140 pound limit. He has a new strength and conditioning coach, uh, a new nutritionist. I believe he has the same nutritionist that uh, Errol Spence has now. So we we, we see that that uh, Regis Progre is, is dedicated to his craft. He's dedicated to making 140, and I think this is going to be a real real good fight. I know uh, Zapata and Progre had a coach. Uh, that, that that worked with both of them i believe that coach is going to sit out this fight so i mean like i said i just think we're going to be in for a real 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 decent real good fight uh i wonder what that undercar is going to look like um or if they're going to try to make it a pay-per-view thing obviously again most of us do not know who marv nation is so it just kind of is what it is with that point but again, man, that was just something quick, man. It's your boy, Truth Show for Truth of Narrative. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to like, comment, and subscribe. Hey, we out.